Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's Browns, man. Back with another video, you feel me? So, basically, I'll be giving y'all my cigs. And, yeah. I mean, not my cigs. I'm gonna give y'all... I'm gonna give you my cigs, too. But I'm gonna give y'all my, uh... A drip tutorial real quick. You know? It's like 1 a.m. right now, so I gotta be quiet and everybody sleep. Yeah, so I'm gonna give you a double tutorial. Here we go. Look, this is my cigarette right here. What the hell just happened? I right, brought LeBron, Pro 2, Pro 6, Basic 1, Pro 4, Kim Walker, None, Pro 5, Pro 5, Number 1. I might switch to Pro 2 though. Cause I like Pro 2. Yeah, I'm gonna use Pro 2 because most people use Pro 2. I switch between those two. So yeah, this gonna be a little quick one. Probably like five, seven minutes. I don't know. All right, look. So basically, if you wanna know how to dribble like me. First step, you gotta learn these cigs. I mean, you gotta put on the cigs and you gotta learn the moves. All right, first thing is the speed boost. The ball in your left hand, you flick it straight up and then move the left stick top left. And then after you see your player get this animation right here, you wanna hold R2. So basically, like this. All right, I didn't do it right that time, but hold on. Like that, right? So look. Basically, you just do it the same the opposite way. The ball on your right hand. Uh, flick it straight up and then move the left stick top right and hold R2. Alright, my bad, y'all. I had to switch controllers. Look, so basically. Some move and spin back, right? It's the next move. Basically, that spin back right there. Now, what you want to do is coming up the court, or not up the court, anywhere you want, right? Ball in your right hand, though. You're running. You want to flick the right stick to the left, and then spin it from right where you flicked it, straight from the left. Basically, from a clock will be from 9 to 6. Just like that. From 9 to 6. While holding R2. No, do, do not hold R2 while you do the spin. You can do it after. So basically, it will look like this right here. Hold on. That's what this spin will look like. Now, if you want to do it when it's in your left hand, you just do the same thing, but just to the opposite side. So basically, you want to flick the right stick to the right, the ball's in your left hand, and you want to roll it from 3 to 6. Clockwise. Just like that, bro. Alright, now next is this move right here. It's a good, it's a combo right here. Basically, that's how you do it. So, uh, no, that's what it looks like I meant. Basically. I mean, it's a good combo. Misdirection, come with the court, like, mm -mm, speed boost, boom. Like that. Basically, you want to start with the ball in your right hand. You want a momentum to the left. If you don't know how to do that, the right stick and the left stick need to go at the same time, straight to the left. Basically, just like that. Now, after you do it like that, you want to flick the right stick up and just do a speed boost. Basically, just speed boost this way. Now, do not hold R2 when you speed boost this time. You're just going to basically just, and then flick it again. Just flick the right stick straight up again after you hit the speed boost. But do not hold R2. Basically. And you can hold R2 after, of course. So the whole combo should like this. Now. That's the first part of one big combo. You hit it like that. Boom. Now after you do that. You want to. When, when your speed was not the court like this. You want to go up. Right. 
you want to do a momentum to the left and a momentum back to the right. Now, basically, it's just mo like a little momentum spam, right? Just two times. Boom, boom. Without the cursor, you can just do it like that. So, in total, it should go like this. Hold up. Like that. Now, this what it should look like. So far. Now, after you do the momentum back to the left, you want to flick it straight up. And then go the opposite way, basically. Like, so, if the ball's in your right hand, after you flick it up, you want to go move the left stick top left. So, in total, it's like this. Like that. Now, after you do that, you want to move the right stick. After you get this little spooky animation, you want to move the right stick straight to the right. Move it back to the left. And then flick it top left. So, it gives you this little in and out animation. Basically, in all, it should be like this. Like that. You shouldn't do the in-between the legs crossover, but that's how it should look. And that's one big combo. Now, I'm going to start teaching you guys individual moves. Alright. So, look. This in and out hezzy right here. You just want to flick it. If the ball's in your right hand, you flick it top right. If the ball's in your left hand, flick it top left. And I want to give you guys a little key, because I see a lot of people. This is how their hezzies look right here. Hold on. This is how everyone's hezzy looks right here. Like theirs, theirs don't do it. Like, like you see how it takes so long to do it? I've seen a lot of guards' hezzies go like that. Because they don't really know how to hezzy, right? What you want to do is you want to hezzy. And see how my player does the animation? You just don't want the ball to touch the ground. So when you hit the hezzy, you run and hold R2. Basic same, same as the speed boost, just with a hezzy. So going this way, hold on. On this way like that same way so that's really the hezzy right there I say get yours fast mine really isn't fast right now because I don't have pro 2 on but yeah all right next is the steady slide this move right here what the hell oh hold up that move right there just running up Basically, you're running up, you just wanna. There it go, damn. <laughs> Basically, the steady slide. So, so you, you wanna get like right here, or you could do anywhere to be honest. And I'm gonna flick the right stick straight left. And then, right after you do that, right after you see your player get this animation, you wanna hold R2 and hold the left stick straight down. So basically, it look like that. Oh, hold on. Yeah, just like that. Alright, so. Next, this is crab right here. It's pretty easy. The ball's in your right hand. You want to hold the right stick. Straight top left. The ball's in your left hand. You want to hold the right stick. Straight top left. Straight top right. Basically, it just goes like that. Over and over. Make sure you don't hold it straight up like I'm doing it sometimes. That's why it gives me that little in between the legs thing. But yeah. It's pretty easy. It's a nice move. You could like. It's pretty it's pretty good, honestly. Alright, next move, next move, next move. This misdirection behind the back. Killer move. Honestly. Alright, so what you want to do is, without holding R2, the ball in your right hand, your right stick goes diagonally down left, so bottom left, and then the left stick goes top left at the same time. Boom. And that's just how you do it, like that. Boom. That's in your right hand. Boom. Now, with the, on your left hand, you do it the opposite way. The left stick goes top right, the right stick goes bottom right. Boom. Now, if you want to do a misdirection, you just let go of the whole controller, right? Let go of the whole controller. 
and then just do the behind the back. Like once you see a player do this little hezzy right here with his hands, the little movement right there with his hands, that's what you want to do the behind the back. So basically it's just like this. Behind the back with this, this weirdo keeps flying, jumping and shit. Basically, that's how. I mean, you'll get better at it eventually. Some some places you can't really just. You just gotta get better. All right, now the next one is the. Oh, you can also quick stop like this. That's a good quick stop. I'm teach you how to do that. Basically, it's a uh, hesitation. You either have Pro 2 or Pro 5 has you on, or Pro 3 for this. Alright, it's basically like that. So it has these speed boosts. So you just literally, when you're running straight to the right, and the ball's in your right hand, or, yeah, the ball's in your right hand, you're running straight to the right, you just flick the right stick diagonally straight right, like, Literally, I said diagonally, just straight right, literally, just straight right, and then hold R2 and run. Yeah. Now, if you want to quick stop off of it like this, all you have to do is uh, tap L2 right after you do it. So basically, it just, boom, just like that. It won't give you no, see, without it, it won't give you no long animation, but you could just... It's actually really good. If you don't know how to do the normal quick stop that everyone's doing, like this quick stop right here. Oh, I didn't get it, but hold on. If you don't know how to get this quick stop right here, then it's also another good quick stop you should do. Yeah, if you don't know how to do that quick stop right there. It's good. And then to the left is the same thing, literally. Just flick it the same way. Or no, the opposite way. Pretty sure you guys know that by now. Alright. Now, next move is the Hezzy behind the back. Hezzy cancel behind the back. You just add all the last three moves all together. Just do that little Hezzy quick stuff I taught you and just do the behind the back right after. It's actually pretty good, like, cause some sometimes you can't really get it behind the back that well. I'm trying to get a bad behind the back, like right there. I didn't get my behind the back. And maybe do that a little. Yeah, that right there. Basically, you do the hezzy, and it works every time, literally. Like, just don't try to do the hezzy behind the back in this little area right here. Like, hold on, like right here. Because it's going to put you at right. As soon as you tap L2, that's going to happen. So if you're going to try to do it behind the back from that close, then do that. All right. Next move is the Hezzy Speed Boost, but Misdirection Hezzy Speed Boost. Basically, you just want to hit the Hezzy and then go the other way. And then you don't even have to keep doing it after that. You could just like move your left stick from top left to right, top right, top left, top right, basically. Yeah, it's actually really good. Really good move. All right, now if you want to do this little walk back glitch. This right here. Uh, first step is you gotta have on Pro 2. You don't have to have on Pro 2, but if you want to look like this, put on Pro 2. And uh, basically, what you wanna do is, at, right after you flick the right stick straight up, you wanna move the left stick, hold it down. Basically like that. You just, you just wanna hold the left stick straight down and then keep spamming it like that. What you want to do is, like, kind of flick it with it, but just don't flick the left stick. Hold it down a little bit longer than flicking it. You don't want to hold it too long. I'm pretty sure you get the hang of it. 
And if you just want to, instead of walk back, you just want to do this right here. Right after you flick the right stick straight up, you want to tap L2. And then if you want to get faster with it, I recommend going off slow like this. Like, starting boom, 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 boom. And then speed up, you feel me? But, uh, dang, I think that's pretty much it. My next one, I'll drop straight combos. That's what it'll be, combos. My next video will be a uh, jump shot, then a face creation, then uh, drippy outfits. Oh, last move. This move right here. This little crab move. It's actually really good. It's better than this crab because you see how long this crab takes right here? Like, if you're going to shoot off of this, you have to go wait till it ends to shoot. But, now nah, with this one, you just have to put the ball in your hand. Like, the hand that it's in. So, basically, if it's in your right hand, you want to flick it, the right stick to the right, while holding R2. And just give you that. And if it's in your left hand, just do the same thing. But, don't hold R2 while, while trying to, like, do something out of it. Because it'll give you this little sham god. If you let go R2, though, after, you can do whatever you want. Like, you feel me? So that's pretty much it. Uh, let me know what you want in the comment section. I know this is like a really sloppy dribble tutorial. It's like like my second one. It's my second time doing this. So yeah, and it's also like 1.30 right now. I'm going to go to sleep after this though. But hope you boys enjoyed the video, man. If you did, make sure you like, subscribe, comment, uh, share to any of your friends. And yeah, bro. The GOAT is out.